It, it's, that, that, it's the problem. People get celebrated for doing dumb shit, so they do more dumb shit. Niggas get killed like that. It would be different. It would be way less challenging if I wasn't trying to do everything. So I direct the movie, I'm in the movie, I write the movie, I edit the movie. Then I gotta go distribute the movie, I gotta market the movie. Then I gotta make the clothes in the movie, I gotta make the music in the movie. But this is a choice I'm making. I, I was gonna say, that's the artist and the one of the That's the art in me. Yeah. Like, I, I, want, I want, if the problem, if it is a problem, and the only people it's a problem to are like my ex-wives, you know what I'm saying? But like, I don't generate the income they want me to, right. but I'm able to make what I need to make. To, 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 to make sure that our company is thriving. I have to build catalogs so I can pass it to my kid. That's the whole purpose of it. Yeah. Was there a deal looking back that you wish you would have better executed? All of them, but I'm not mad. I could have, you know, now that I'm 52, I would do every single thing better now. now. Every single thing I would have done with a different perspective and lens, but I think I did pretty good for like first time doing anything, yeah. so yeah. I caught a deal, I was, you know, a label that caught a multiple and able to sell it. I would have done it different, but not many people could do that. Would you probably wouldn't have sold early or? I, it wasn't my choice. Jay and a big, I mean, Jay wanted to sell. Yeah. Yeah. This, um, just again, for us, this is big. Just for me personally meeting you and uh, being able to see you in the flesh and someone that has, you know, I don't know how much inspiration that you know that you put out here, but people are listening to your message. And to me, you would be a blueprint of, you know, what we should be striving for and being self-sustainable. So I just wanted to like, give my respects to you. Thank you. Appreciate that. The best respect is action, you know. So as long as you can take what I told you or you heard me say and apply it and become profitable and take care of your family and don't use it to, like, destroy the culture mm -hmm. and make negative images. Yeah. You know, we got, we that's get, the best we appreciation. Get in trouble. We get in trouble. I don't want to get in trouble. I'm saying yeah. showing the best images. You know, that's the challenge on our end, though. Showing be the best honest. images? Yeah, because, um, and this is me being candid for our audience. I, I'd like to be authentic with them, is that uh, we do positive stuff, but they don't get no views. And then when you do the, the clickbait bullshit, they, they flock to it and your numbers is up. So how do you sustain a company in this? You just uh, got to do fly shit. I find that a lot of times if I say something prolific, it goes viral. That's not negative. Yeah. Well, you, you, I mean, you Dame Dash, I mean, <laughs> you know, so it's a little bit of different metrics, but. No, you just got to say something prolific. You have to do something prolific. Yeah. So if you like giving out turkeys and shit, nobody wants to see that. You have to do something that no one's seen before that's positive. That's the challenge and that's the art. I, I was looking, going, I had the same conversation with my daughter. You know, she was like, you know, and, and, and she was like, but things have to be negative for it to go. And I was like, my shit. That's negative goes, but there's some positive shit that goes as well, mm. you know? But you have to create a different algorithm. Yeah, and that's going against the grain, and that's the, the, the path of a journey, man. It, it just constant good shit turns into an algorithm. You can manipulate an algorithm like that, but most people that manipulate things are doing what's the easiest and the most negative. But it's no, it's no art in monetizing negative shit. It's not an art. It's cheating. Yeah. But that's the artist in me. I'm not the entrepreneur. But that's, the biz, that's the business part. I don't give a fuck about the business part. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't care. I, I don't care. You know, like, I got to figure out a different way to make money. So I'll do this and do a positive and make money doing something else. But if the only way I can make bread is, like, to make, like, clickbait or something that's negative, then you're in the wrong business. You gotta get in the business where you get praised for doing good shit. Right. You know, when you make a good movie and it gets in the festival, that shit goes, you make money from positive shit, it's right. just harder. Pause. Right. It's not the easiest thing to be positive, but so what? Life's not meant to be easy. Did you know, you, that, that's, you, that's, 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 if you wanna call that a challenge, been my challenge. I won't fucking hurt my culture for money. Mm. Cause every time you put out something that's negative, it hurts our culture. In what can you like? In what way? Have if you, you show done? a fight and some catty shit, or have two black people fighting each other, you know, opinions of each other, and they get into a beef and da 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 da, that's not good for us, is it? No, nah, it doesn't help. It doesn't. It, help. It's that, that, it's the problem. People get celebrated for doing dumb shit, so they do more dumb shit. Niggas get killed like that. For sure.
uh, like how many how many murders you think happen starting from bullshit said that on 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 either Instagram, Twitter, or YouTube? How many niggas you think got killed? I know a couple. A lot. Yeah. So it can't be good for our culture. And you know what's happening every time that happens? They're laughing at us. So they make make us think it's okay to do negative shit for money. But when somebody gets killed, that shit ain't funny. And a kid doesn't know no better. They can't see the future. So a kid doesn't know what it looks like to be in jail as a kid. You know what I mean? Nobody's telling them that. They're just showing them how tough they are and how many views they get for, you know, saying that they c c committed a crime publicly. Mm -hmm. But then when they're doing that 50, 60 years, it ain't that, you know, and when you, you grow up and you're like, oh, shit, I literally just did 40 years for some shit I did when I was 12, when I, my brain wasn't developed. Mm. People are manipulating that. You know what I'm saying?